That's right, this horror game can hear me. This is a game called Fears to Fathom. It's a horror game based off of real stories that people have told the creator, and he's turned them into a game. And trust me, the fact that these are real is terrifying, because this game is one of the scariest games I've played in years. Seriously, I have not had a game build tension better in a very long time. I was on the edge of my seat, throughout. And the fact that I couldn't even talk to my chat to try and get me through it because the game would hear me made this 10 times worse. So if you love horror and you do enjoy this, please feel free to subscribe. I do plenty of live horror content over on my Twitch all the time, which you should check out. But if for whatever reason you can't check out the live streams, sub to this channel so you never miss the re-upload of the ones here. Anyways, all that being said, I hope you enjoy this stream. Let's do this, people. Home Alone, the first episode of Fears to Fathom. You have a storage chair, so it is based off of real stories. Home Alone. The first real story. Let me just spin my camera a bit to the left. A little bit off to the side. I didn't want to put this up on Reddit just for it to be called a piece of fiction. I don't even know where to start. Oh, these really are true stories. No one would just reference Reddit in fiction. Excuse my lack of good storytelling skills. No one's just... No one is saying I, I want to put this on Reddit before like a fake story. Redditors have never lied. We know this. I guess I'll just start. Okay. It was in the middle of summer. My parents had left for that weekend due to a work trip. Which meant I was all by myself for the weekend. Also, I feel like I do have to mention that my sleep schedule was really messed up around this time. I would sleep and get up at just about any time of the day. Though I did plan on fixing that. That's good to hear. I'm glad that they, they planned on, like, you know, bettering themselves. That's always important in life. I always try to be better than I currently am. I'm pretty perfect right now, but, you know, not perfect, perfect. What's that noise? Hello? Oh my god, the mouse is super sensitive. Hold on. Let's turn the DPI down. That's a bit better. Space to get up. Cool. Hello! Okay, so this is my bedroom. Cool, I got some books. I got a plate. You should take that downstairs. Fuzzy Owl, thank you for the prime. This is my neighborhood. Am I, like, on the second floor of the house? I am. Okay, so no one's gonna break in this window, most likely. They can't interact with the windows. No, it is. What's in here? Hmm. I did have homework that night, but I was too hungry to do it right after waking up. Okay, so I gotta go eat. Don't like these windows. Why? What's wrong with them? They're just windows. These are normal. Normal amont. Press escape to read messages. Uh, oh wait, hold on. Wait, when are you guys gonna be back? This is a text with Mum. We also have Mason Oliver, who I guess is also our friend. Let, let's read um, Mum texts first. All right. Wait, when are you guys gonna be back? Dad and I are gonna be back on Monday, honey. Didn't I tell you that yesterday? Cool. Take care, honey. Sleep on time. I hope you get the Xbox like. What? I hope you get the Xbox like you promised. I mean, if you get that discount. Like two hours later. Can I invite Mason and Josh over for the night, for homework? Of course you can. Call me if you need anything. Make sure to check it's them on the door before opening it. Check through the blinds. Take care, honey. Sure thing, Mum. Then I may uh, be back by Sunday evening instead of Monday. That's nice. Why are you being so paranoid, Mum? I'm 14. God! 14-year-olds are perfectly responsible human beings who should be trusted. Does she not know that or something? I think I'm probably going to take a little nap. Probably going to order some pizza. Yes. I need to order anything. Already made you lasagna this morning. Check the fridge. Okay, and then Mason. Mason's one of the friends, right? Okay, cool. Yo, yo. Come to Jessica's tomorrow. Yeah, her Josh is coming too. What about you? I don't know. What's wrong? Weren't you going to see her yesterday? She didn't show up. It's like I don't even matter to her. You matter. Unless you multiply yourself by the speed of light squared, then your energy. I like Mason. 
I'm, I'm, I fuck with Mason. Mason's kind of cool. I like that about him. That's a good joke. It's a good physics joke. Um, he's... I right, call him a nerd all you want. I think his joke's cool. Fuck you. Uh, Jack, if you think this game is cool, you should really play the game Love Sam. Oh, actually, he's about to read, isn't it? Thank you for the uh, tip, Jack, by the way. Jack, if you like this game, you should play the game Love Sam. It's a really good psychological horror game, and I think you'd enjoy it a lot. I'll give it a go. I'll give it a go. Yeah, everyone's saying nerd. Fuck you guys. How's Ken? Uh, totally forgot. Probably gonna do it tonight. Lost same. My parents are, uh, are out for the night. Wanna come over? We play Mario Kart 2. I'll let you know. Okay, cool Josh 2. I can't promise, dude. May have plans with that. Okay, they're all the texts. Either way, lasagna in the fridge. That's what's important. What's this room? Okay, the door flings you. Don't ask me why, but I went straight into my parents' room. Two months, even though I've been watching you for over two years, smiley face. Oh. Hello? The fuck? That was a creepy little figure looking into the house. Okay. Interesting. What time is it? 8.03 p.m. So it ain't too late yet. It's like a time where people are going to be out and about, but it's evening. It's evening time. Alright. Interesting. Buggy, but no one there. Alright. Into the living room. Things seem okay. Oh, I can watch TV! Oh, well, this is fine. Why aren't the lights on? Because I was in bed. We're at a cost of living crisis. What, you think I could just afford to leave the lights on when I'm in bed? And some of the lights are on. Feth the beat. Thank you for the prime, by the way. Chucky pig. Interesting. Either way, there's lasagna in the fridge. Ooh! Some lasagna! Press- food was cold. Press G to throw. <laughs> Put it in the microwave. Do we own a microwave? What kind of fucking people don't- Own a microwave! Sorry. I put it in the oven? Oh, okay, I guess I heat it in the oven. Is that oven noise? How long should I leave that in there? Is that gonna burn if I leave it too long? I don't own a microwave, I use an air fryer as a microwave. Oh, okay! Fucking... <laughs> Fuck you. Food is nice and hot. I liked watching TV while I ate. Okay. Someone's like, oh, I own an air fryer. It's like a meme. It's like, you clearly don't own an air fryer. It's that fucking meme. You are that meme. Shit, I guess I have to turn the TV on. I like that I can throw my Zanya. Ah, yes! It also takes me five bites to eat lasagna. Oh, wait, no, this might be four. Mmm! I feel like a ginger little kitty right now! I feel like a ginger, kind of bodacious kitty! And let me tell you something, I hate Mondays. I was already feeling very sleepy after eating the food. I literally just... Like, who's just in bed? Oh, what the fuck? Thought I heard a noise. Hello, Mason Oliver. Let's read your texts. We're gonna have to call it off, man. Something just came up. 
But you gotta come to Jessica's tomorrow. Okay? Why, why did I not? Who's Jessica? Yeah, I don't know, man. She was kind of rude to me, you know? That shit ain't right, man. Like, that shit ain't cool. Send? Send? How do I... Send? How do I send it? Okay, I guess I can't send it. Whatever, I don't I don't wanna I don't wanna text him anyway. Fuck that guy. Fuck Jock Fuck Mason. Someone walked up the stairs. I don't think so. I'm sorry Miles, gotta see you tomorrow. Don't forget Cam. Shut up, dude, all good. I'll probably just go back to bed after Cam. The ambient music in this is really, like, creepy. Colbs, thank you for the prime. Appreciate it. Oh, okay. So it's, 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 it's like midnight. I got done with homework for the day in about a few hours. It took you like four hours, man. That's not too late, you kids. I shouldn't uh, get to hear from Mrs. Paula this time. You old hag. Go make some potions or something. Get off my back. Told her. Anyway, let's go to bed. Bedtime! Shadow Wizard Money Gang. Wait. <clears throat> Shadow Wizard Money Gang. We love casting spells. Wait. <clears throat> I feel like I can... Shadow Wizard Money Gang. We love casting spells. I'm in a dream right now. I, th I think I've gotten up, but I haven't. I can tell by my foggy vision. Something ain't right. Some shit's gonna happen, man. Some shit's gonna happen. I'm on edge. I'm on edge, bro. Okay. Where are the glasses? How do I... Is it in the fridge? Okay. I so feel like I'm gonna get jump scared. Whoa! Why do I keep glitching? Miles, who's that at the door? You there? Fuck, no, I just... Hide? Why am I hiding? I wanted to go to bed, not hide! I want to sleep! The door's locked, so like, even if they're outside, they can't fucking do anything. Oh, bro. Seriously, I have to go... Fuck you! Fuck you, guy at the door. I kind of forgot this game can hear me. I don't want to go confront the guy at the door anymore. He heard me say fuck you. 
Hey, Buster, leave! I've got a gun in here! This is America and I have a gun! I'm a 14 year old! You know this! Four? Mom, where'd you get this photo from? Paula sent me. Said she he's been creeping through the windows. We're calling the cops. You kids lock every door and you hide in your room. Dance to the door no matter what he does. Alright, never mind. Back up. I'm hiding! Wait, maybe it isn't locked? Bada boom. Hello, Jack Manifold. Don't worry, it's just Deliveroo. Oh. Creaking on the stairs. I don't think I I'm hiding, I'm hiding.
think we really have a choice. I, I honestly think the game, this is a video game. You know what? Sometimes my brain remembers that this is just a video game. No, no. Simulator. We won! That was the good ending! We were doing the right thing! This is why, this is what you should do in a home invader scenario. You should always listen to your parents. Well done, us. And the game just closes, is that it? Wow. Well, fuck! The game literally just closed. Well, you ignored your mum, you didn't listen. Oh, true! Yeah, I didn't. Yeah, she said it's Paula. Fuck. Yeah, no, I- I mean, look, man. Hiding's the best thing. Like, what the fuck is Paula gonna do? Like, you know, if, you know if she went, oh, it's Superman at the door? Maybe, yeah, I let Paula in. Like, may maybe if Paula is, like, superhuman, we let Paula in a little bit. But, like, honestly, while ever there might be an intruder in the house, you know? Apparently there's a- there's a different ending though. Apparently I got the good ending. Let's try for a... A different ending. That only took us half an hour, we can- I'm slightly scared of the other ending though, you know? Oh, okay, that just opens like... You have to actually boot the other game. Yeah, I guess we just try for, like, the other ending. <laughs> try the bad one. Maybe we will. Alright. Do you want to put this on Reddit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do, 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 do. It's all real. You know, we, we know this. Let's, let's like, speed run the, the start this time. Yes, I'm awake! It's 8 p.m. Woke up around 8 after a nap that evening. I ran immediately downstairs at the speed of light. I read my mum's texts. There's lasagne in the fridge. I sprinted into the kitchen at fucking Mark 10. I opened that shit, grabbed a sagne, put it in the oven. Looked out of the window. No one to be seen. Yippee. We can go out into the garden. Three months. Three. I don't want to do that. Is it like a lock the doors, like? Hold on, wait. Is there like a lock the doors option?
So I remember seeing him out there at one point. I wonder if I can like... Is there like an option to like hold the lasagna and throw like piping hot lasagna at the guy? That could be quite a fun ending. Okay, wait, hold on. Fucking devoured that shit. Alright, instead of lasagna, this is what I want to do. Mason Olivier. You missed him walking up the stairs, lol. I want to try this this time. I've got a new plan. Oh, yeah. Homework. I've got a different plan this time to try and get the other ending instead of going downstairs. Because it, it scares me. What? I missed what? He's in there. He walked up. He's already in the parents' room. Alright. Man! Man in the house! Come and murder me! I know you're in my parents' room! Open the door! You bell! You're a dickhead. You're a dickhead, bruv. Open that door. I'm about to back out the Rambo, fam. Open that door. Why did the ambience stop? I know you are in my home. Come out. Come out. Oh, fucking hell. I didn't do that as far as I was concerned. That scared the fuck out of me. Oh my god. Come out of the closet. You can hide in the closet. Oh, wait, no. He... Now I'm actually on edge because, like, I, 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 I've shouted at him too much and I'm scared that he's going to, like, kill me. Oh, now I'm on edge. Check this game isn't the listening one. Oh. There's 
The first chapter can't hear you. Oh. Fuck. Fuck. Look at the door out the window. I am, I can't see anything. Can't see anything. Okay. Who's at the door? Back door. I swear the back door was open. Oh, was it open? Oh my god. I'm really on edge. I don't know why, because I know our goal here is to die because we want to see the death ending, but like, for some reason... I don't like that bottle anyway. Um, okay. Let's just... Oh! Hello. Open it, no balls. I have balls! What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> ah! <laughs> it appears I did not have balls. No balls. I didn't have them. My bad guys. My bad guys. Zero balls. I didn't have those. I was actually castrated. I forgot. My bad guys. I completely forgot about that when they cut my balls off. I forgot about when that happened. I just kind of suppressed the memory because it kind of sucked when they cut off my balls. But, yep, don't have them anymore. Just remembered. Uh, well, 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 well. Um, is there another ending? Is there more endings worth, like, learning? Or is it worth just... I mean, we survived our first playthrough. Do we go on to the second episode? Or do we carry on with... Is there anything else to see in one? What are we saying? Next one, a lot of people saying second. All right, let's go on to the second episode. This one might be a, bit, a little bit longer. Let's see if this one's any better. Any longer, sorry. Better, it's actually pretty good. That was a, quite a scary experience for how simple it is. There's literally only one moment you could potentially get scared, but then it's really good at building like, I don't know. Oh, the settings this time, cool. What's AA? Oh, anti aliasing. Cool. Mm. Okay. Well, about 40 minutes. Alright. Cool. Well, this one's a little bit longer, and apparently this one can hear you. I thought that all of them could hear you, but apparently the first one can't. 
This one, however, can hear you. The only thing is, I'm kind of worried. Let me just double check before we play it, actually. Let me double check that the mic's set up properly, because there's a chance it might not be. Um, and if it isn't, then it's going to be really boring. Uh, so let me... Uh, sound. Default mic. Yeah, it's the wrong mic. There we are. Hello! Yeah, okay, it works. Cool. Yeah, it was set to the wrong mic anyway, so even if the last one could hear me, it wouldn't have done. So, um... Yeah. This one, this one, when it, it will be able to hear me. Alright. Episode 2, Norwood Hitchhike. I think I clicked through it too quick. It, it's, it, it seems to have frozen. It seems to have froze. I think I clicked through it a bit quick. Oh yeah, they get crashed. Oh no. Okay. Fears to Fathom, episode 2. Norwood Hitchhike. June 16th. This happened to me when I was 19. I'm a little over 21 now. I still remember this very clearly because of how creeped out I felt. I was a bit hesitant to write this out for the internet at first, but getting it out may help, even if just a little bit. I was one of those people that loves gaming conventions. A furry. I'd go to every furry convention. <laughs> just changes the narrative. I was one of those people that love furry conventions. I'd go to every furry convention I get the chance to. And sometimes even meet some of my online friends. Though my parents were always thrilled at the idea of me going on interstate drives, but a plane ticket would have been too expensive. This convention I went to... Wait, what? This furry convention I was at went great. And now it was the day to drive back home. But I set, when I set off, I soon realised that the traffic was horrible. I decided that I'd take the long way to avoid the traffic. It was a little over a 12 hour drive. 20 hours in an old van. I hear. A little bit more than 12. Used to be where I used to drive. Oh yeah. Whee! You shouldn't text and drive. Okay. Let's read these before we, you know. Dad, okay. You called? Yeah, I think I'm going to that convention. Can I get your car for like five days, please? With who? Aiden, that internet friend? He's a nice guy. No, you're not going on a town, I'll drive by yourself. Well, I've already made up my mind. I'll drive you. Why don't you understand anything? Let's talk when I get home. Very harsh, full caps, why don't you understand anything? Drive safe, Holly. Don't forget to call me. You got it, Dad. Uh, link to Aiden's phone number, leave it now. Drive safe, Holly. Okay. Discord, we got tickets, so? Oh, just another car. Cool. Let's keep reading. So, their dad was reluctant to let them go, but they've allowed it now. Discord, we got tickets, so? I'll see if I can get the car. Let me know, uh, uh, let you know. We're finally going to take Milo on the walk, lol. Alright, lol. Okay, the plan is on. Hell yes! Wait, you're getting the car? Yep, big girl. Trash can't come? I'll get the skateboard too, so it's really cool skateboard nearby. Sounds fun. Discord, where are you? Almost there. I don't see you. Peach shirt? It was fun, I had a good time. Thanks for joining me. Are you sure you, uh, again, you sure driving all the way back? I don't have a choice now, do I? Could have left tomorrow morning. Okay, give me a call when you reach back to your cave. Okay, Dad. Sure, it'll be this lifetime now. What do you mean? So you're the biggest traffic jam in the country. It sucks. It's not too good here either. I think it's uh, from people that left the convention. That's it, I'm rewritten here. Go do what you gotta do. Alright. Just basically what we already know. Nothing new. Oh! This better be copyright free. Definitely speeding, but fuck it. Why did you get pulled over? Where did you reach? I'm driving, Dad. Come on now. Oh, I need fuel. Now, halfway through the drive, I realized I was low on gas. That ain't too good. That is not good. Told you, uh, still about six hours away from the city. 
What does it say? Dad, fucking bro. Uh, got stuck in a jam. Told you to take that flight. Oh, it's gonna be late when you reach back. Hope you're feeling all right. Look, bro. I, please stop making me stop. Because at the end of the day, I run out of fucking gas. Gas station. I recognise that song. What's that song? Alright. It's late, kinda creepy, but nothing too bad so far. Is the person driving in their first suit? You'd only assume so. Oh! Hello! Hi, can I get $10 on pump two? Hello? Okay. Am I just caught in this dialogue? Uh. Hello? Dude! Let me out of this fucking dialogue, bro! Goofy R man. Absolute size of that lad. That is a big man. Is that James Marriott? Don't be rude. Um. Press the dots. Oh. I didn't realize there was a dialogue option. My bad. You head into the bridge by yourself? The bridge? The Norwood Valley Road, I mean. Not a lot of people head down there this time of year. Be careful. Thanks. I'm not joking, ma'am. Be careful. It's not safe out there. For about a century now, many people have been going missing down there. And people who went looking for them never returned. Ooh. Ooh. I will say the Noble Valley monst a monster had torn them up and hung them upside down on trees. Use the toilet. It's not cleaned. Fucking hell, I did like a 360 because the DPI was so high and he jump scared me. Duh! There will be consequences. Oh, it's uh, just another dude. I fucking shit myself. You heard about the Norwood Valley monster? Huh? Never mind. I'm going to call the cops. This is the- Yo, you know what? I think I- uh, Unironically, I think I survive. This is how I survive, I swear. I just pick shit up and throw it at him. He calls the cops. They drive me home. Man, please stop that. I will not stop. Or he jump scares me, one or the other. Ma'am, please stop. Oh, is he not gonna. Ma'am, please. Okay, but just. Uh, it's only if I throw them at him. What are you doing? Throwing shit at you, bro. Arrest me then. You said you were gonna call the cops? Do it. Oh, he don't care. You just throw shit at him. What are you doing? I, I, I'm convinced this is the way to go. That way I get jump scared. I'm scared because... What are you doing over... What are you doing over there? Nothing. Man, please stop that. Nope. I'm gonna keep throwing some... Whatever the fuck this is called at you. There will be consequences. No, there won't. There isn't going to be. There's gonna be... N You're gonna do... You ain't gonna do shit. Wait, maybe he will... Maybe he actually won't do shit. Hold on. I'm beginning to think he won't actually do shit. I'll be honest, I don't think he's doing it. Punch him in the face. I don't think you can. Yeah, I'll be honest, I actually begin to think he really won't do anything. Yeah, okay.
Where are you headed? He just looked at me. I like like the PS2 style like scanned face. PS1, sorry, style like scanned faces. Okay, yeah, you literally. You can throw as much as you want at that guy. He ain't gonna do shit. Oh, steel. That's a good idea. You need to pay for that, man. Nope. Nope. I ain't gonna do it. I'm right, fine. Fuck you. And one more thing. If you see a woman in a white or blue gown trying to get a ride, do not stop. Just don't want the gas as hard as you can. Why? Some people say that she died in a car accident there on prom night. Some say that she seeks vengeance after she was murdered there. Regardless, she's out for blood. Whatever you do, never, ever, under any circumstances, pick up a hitchhiker. Those people out there on the road putting their thumbs out, they ain't what you think, man. They just ain't. I'ma leave. Hey, what's my mother said? Fuck you, man. Why'd you fucking home? Holly, mom, I don't know if you find any shops at this hour, but we're out of dog food. Could you get something from Milo? I'll pay you back. For fuck's sake. Hey, dude, that I threw all the shit at. Do you have dog food? Is this dog food? Apple chips. Do you have... Do you have dog food, bro? I, I didn't really realize I was going to have to come back here. Now I'm embarrassed about the throwing shit thing. But I didn't know. Oh my god, alcohol! Let's drink and drive! Absolutely, we should drink and drive. I didn't need it. No, but I want it. Dick, dipshit. Oh. That'll be five dollars, man. Pay. Why can't we drink and drive? The consequences. This game sucks. Also, the next ad's gonna run in four minutes. I'm just telling you people. If you wanna miss out on the minute long ad that runs at the top of the hour. Because the top of the hour will happen in a few minutes time. And do subscribe now, or you might miss out on gameplay. And also, you're gonna avoid all the ads for the next 30 days, so it's pretty good value. Could just put that in the trunk. Alright, fine. In the trunk it goes then. Doesn't really feel like it went in properly, I'll be honest. Witherly, thank you for the prime! Woo! Fuck it up! Fuck it up! Fuck it up! Not sure why, but at first I went on without getting gas. No! I thought we got the gas! Okay, you convinced me. Also, Pog drinking and driving. Yes! Did you hear recently Joe Biden says that, um... You should only go to jail for crimes, and he doesn't see drinking and driving as a crime. Let's go get the gas. Don't ever buy no weed from the gas station, bro. Which Trump? Which which pump did we get money on? Do you remember which pump we got the money on? Was it pump four? Pump two. Cool. Daisy Duck, thank you for the tier one. Was that a grunk reference? I don't think so, but I don't know. Cool guy, I like Gronk. Why did you always try and kill me? Why are you driving on the wrong side of the road? Being on the road, you do realize the thing. What's that thing? No advert story, it's about to happen. Monsters do truly exist, and every time, every single one of them looks just like you and me. What does that mean? Each time I turn a corner, I walk a little faster. Why are my lights gone off? 
put those lights on. Surprisingly, there was dog food. Um, okay, cool. Ads in one minute! Guys! Just like Colin Jones and Daisy Duck and Egg C, the people who are going to be avoiding the ads, you should sub too. For the low, low price of 4 or for free with the Prime. Shit, please don't go out. Please don't go out. The local buy, I think you can say, well. Music is amazing. It is. It's really nice. Shit. Just sort of stick behind this guy. No, 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 you fuck! Oh, you fucker! Oh, thank God. Ebby, thank you for the gifted sub! Ad will start any second. I hope you don't miss any excellent driving. But thank you, for, if you do want to watch the ads, it really does appreciate I do appreciate it, seriously. If you're watching an ad, it means a lot. Supports the channel heavily. Seriously, you don't understand. If you see a person, run her over. I think I will not. Ooh, we're on a dirt road now. Oh, here's the bridge. This is that famous bridge. Shall I hope the ads don't kick in right as we go over the famous bridge. Oh, the light's gonna go out before we get across the bridge in it. Hold on, space, thank you for tier one! Ooh. Driving at night is really therapeutic for me. Yeah, I used to think that as well. I used to love driving at night. Well, at least it used to be. Ooh. I think it's gonna go off and there's gonna be a lady in the road. I'm gonna swerve around her, I ain't stopping. That was like an abandoned car or some shit as well. What's that noise? What the fuck is that noise? The ad's playing, by the way. I appreciate you guys watching it. There's this very weird thing about night. Oh, fuck off. Am I gonna have to get out the car? Fuck! Welcome back. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to get out and move these logs. Shift. Move, logs, move! You get back in the whip! You have to. They are sufficiently moved! You can hear shit. Let me back in the fucking car, man. Oh, how did I expect this shit? Oh, fuck. That's not good. Not how to fix a fucking engine. No phone service? Oh my fucking god, this is terrifying. I'm not just saying that I was starting to believe whatever the bullcrap the gas station clerk pulled out. I wouldn't be lying if I said I didn't feel the slightest bit of unease. I don't mean to make this sound like a cliche horror story, but... Throughout my life I was told not to take rides from strangers. But at that moment, I had no choice. Fuck! 
I was scared to think how long it would take someone to pass. Thank you for the uh, subs and primes, by the way, that came over the ads. Sheepish, it's live. Thanks so much. Also, thank you for hitting the sub goal. It means a lot. This sucks. Oh, okay. 10.23 p.m. I saw a car nearing. You did? Oh. Hey. Hey. Fucker. Pure evil. I don't understand how an another human being could leave someone stranded like that. I would absolutely do that. No offense. I do not care. I'm picking up some fucking stranger. Ah, no, maybe I'd stop for him. I don't know, though. I've been told that place is a murder place. Check your phone. Uh, I don't think anyone's messaged me. Yeah, no one's messaged me. My real life phone? Uh, James Marriott said, why am I tagged? Because I, I don't know, he strikes me as the home intruder type. Hello? Oh, of course you stop. Creepy truck. Of course creepy truck stops. Fuck. This is scary. Hey. You're the girl from the gas station. Thank you so much for stopping. What are you trying to do out here? My Jack Manifold. Down. Transgender Manifold. approved. Slay Eggman. Thank you, trans people. That means a lot. Eggman is also pretty cool, so I'm glad you approve of him too. I can't call for help, there's no phone service. You think I can get a ride? Where are you heading? Just up the road. Uh, just the nearest stop where I can call for help. I'll be in, thanks so much. Could you wait till I can get my stuff? Hurry up, just throw it in the back. I won't be here for too long. Kira, thank you for the five gifted subs, appreciate it. He's doing okay. He's nice. Definitely just get the dog food. That's the most important. This is how you get kidnapped? Yes, I'm aware of that, but what else? What other option do I have? Get a Glock. Get your fursuit. I'm still wearing it. Canonically, I've decided I'm still wearing this fursuit, so don't worry. I only had two hands back then. Nowadays, she does have uh, three, but you know, back then she had two. Commit Grand Theft Auto. Someone put Grand Theft as if they were Irish. Uh, I'm done. Finally. Now hop in and be quick. Let's go. Turn the radio on or some shit. You. So you won't tell me who you are, or where you're going. I'd rather not say if that's okay. If you say so. Okay, cool. You took that well. Hey, dude, you're driving kind of slow. Can we? Speed up a little bit. You really look out to be on this side of town tonight. Uh, um, thank you, man. Yeah, no, I appreciate it. Uh, I must say, you're one brave young woman. What's that supposed to mean? Got any clue what happened to your car back there? It was the battery. It's an old car. That's it? I think so. This guy's a little bit weird. He's just got like creepy vibes. So, what do you think about what he told you back at the gas station? He's funny. Interesting. 
And it tells it to every person traveling down here. Hello? What? Oh, so is it true? What, the monster? Let's see, I've never seen the monster for myself, but there are... There are some things. I'm afraid your car breaking down could have been one of them. Hey, listen. I don't want to sound like that moron, but just remember this. You don't bother them, and you don't be bothered. It's good advice, generally. Yeah, fair enough. You know, I'm sorry for being a jerk to you before. I'm not the best with people. Oh, Oh, bless him! No, I feel kind of guilty. Well, then what if he fucked with the car? Like, because he sees you at the gas station and then he picks you up later down the road? What if, like, he fucked with the car with the intent of doing this? He could be sus still. He could do that. Midnight. After a little bit of small talk, he dropped me by a motel. Apparently they offered roadside assistance. Besides, I thought I could use a little rest. Be careful, there are all kinds of people out there, he said ominously before leaving. Okay, so he was fine. We would assume. Not approved for, for occupancy. Oh, we can buy like a collar or stuff. I like that I can buy. I'm gonna buy our onion rings because they're cheap and they increase my sprint speed, which I might want. That also implies to me that there is gonna 100% be a section where I have to run. Oh, I have to consume them, okay. Bro, you are grey, bro! Man was putting out the creepiest vibes imaginable. Yeah, I'll need a room to shack up for tonight. How much is it for the room? Um, yes, I'm only going to be here a few hours. $40 for single. Pay cash only. Room number nine, right over there. $90, Tommy will take care of it next thing in the morning. Alright, we're getting the car fixed. Cool. Good, I'll let Tommy know. And one last thing. Try not to wake the other guests. They might not take very nicely to it. Alright, I'm gonna be quiet now. Because that has got me on edge about. Oh. She's got me on edge about waking people up, so we're gonna be quiet in case we wake anyone up and they kill us. Yippee! 14 months just reminding everyone that you might have a prime sub without even knowing if you only use mobile. Go check on a laptop. So true, bestie. Thank you for the sex number, by the way. I'd scream, but, you know. doing here? You scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Who are you? I'm Tommy, room service. Here at Railway Inn. Fire stuff over in Norwood. What are you doing here? You know, cleaning stuff. Got the front desk came in this room. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I'm gonna have you to step outside while I make the room. Just get my stuff. 
You're weird, brother. You're proper weird. What a weird Don. Energy soda. I'm just gonna buy one. But it just said something then, and I was like, "All right, I guess I'll have one." Joe about the situation. What is wrong with these people? Mercy, mercy, mercy. But don't you worry, it's safe here. I'll go get your car. And also, the room's phone is not working. Need anything, just ask at the front desk. We've been trying to get it fixed, but we haven't been seeing enough guests lately. Hit, hit, hit. But you have a good night. Slow, slow, Joe. I'll close this door before someone sneaks in when I'm at least su su suspect it. Oh, my sprinting stuff. Oh, fucking hell. Lord almighty, Joe. Different, yeah, Pat Matt. I'm gonna keep a little bit quiet by the way. I don't know if the game can hear me right now or not. I assume it can only hear me when the audio meter is on screen, but who knows. See if he can call my dad. Right over there, room number nine it is. Yeah, I know. I wonder if you could help by calling my dad. I'm guessing not then. So go, I know. Thank you. Your IRL dad? No. I mean, he's probably still awake. He's probably watching the stream, actually. Hi, Mum and Dad. They watch the stream most of the time. Okay, yep. Yeah. Boy, you're proving your point. Foresight, but there's something very off about that place.
Oh, wait, was the coffee in the room? I figured it was at the vending machine. Coffee machine is outside. Where? Oh, uh, is it at the front? That's just bad. I think the coffee was drugged. Three eighteen AM. I was sedated. Fuck.
Are you sure it can't hear me right now? Okay, it can't. I... In the last one, the doorbell rang and rang and rang and rang, but waiting was the answer. I saw him go and sit in the closet. He's in the closet. I know he is. I, I am certain that the right thing to do is just to let it ring. He's going to get pissed. He's going to be like, oh, fine. I'm sure of it. I'm sure. He definitely is in the closet. Okay, so what do I do? Leave the room, I guess? Right? Fucking moving. I ain't fucking moving. I ain't fucking moving. I ain't fucking moving. This is the right thing to do. Someone at the door and someone in the closet. He has a key. Open them. Get in here. I just someone's in the closet. I watched him walk in there. Right as we were waking up. Get under the bed. Fuck. Okay, I think we do have to just... Wait, do I just get back in bed or... Okay, I do. I do. guy that owns the motel. I trust him enough. I saw who it is. I think we should open it. Hey, bro. I didn't. What are you making all those goofy noises for? I have no coffee machine here. Okay. I guess I've been making goofy noises of us been going because of the coffee. I didn't mean to. Come on, let's fucking go. Come on, brother. This guy's kind of weird, but I trust him more than creepy closet man. Fuck. There ain't nothing here. There ain't nothing here. Oh. I think he left. Go back to the room. For some reason, his demeanor completely changed. 
So go back now. I'm beginning to trust him more. Alright. Thank you to my dad for the 30 months of subbing, by the way. Closet is open. Yeah, I think the guy left. I saw a guy walk away from one of the blocks right as the guy's demeanor changed. So I'm going to assume... Don't take strange pills. Oh, yeah, maybe that was a bad idea. You're right. That was silly. Okay. Uh, what about everyone else? I took your pills, crazy man! I mean, it worked, I can see now, but... What do I do? key, right? People are saying I have to go to the door first, so. Hello.
keyboard so loud. To this day, I find it really weird that the manager inferred not to get police involved as it would have affected the motel's reputation and let go of the situation. I believe that the town could have been home to a cult or a drug ring or possibly something even worse. Tommy arrived with the car after what felt like a year. I never went on long road trips again. I would always take airplanes. <laughs> Oh! Okay, we won that time. We survived. Tommy? Holy- Tommy in it, guys! Tommy in it saved us! Holy! Holy moly! Tommy in it actually saved us. That is crazy. Guys. That is freaking phenomenal. That is freaking amazing and phenomenal. Wow. Just wow. Wow. Well, I don't think that one's worth going back and trying to die. Like, realistically, it's a very long episode only to have, again, one sort of intruder segment that we could kind of fuck up. So we won't. Literally woman simulator. Yeah, that's all like... I'm a dude, and even when he was like, no, please, pretty lady, I was like, oh, shit's uncomfortable as fuck. But yeah, let's see how long the next episode is. If it's really long, we'll do it in a separate stream, but if it's if it's not too long, we'll do it now. Kind of, kind of depends. True story, yeah, that's the problem. These are all based on true stories. All music tracks copyright free. Hell yeah! The camera cut for a second there. Carson House. It's about an hour. And usually it's taking me longer as well. I tell you what then. Hmm. All right, for you guys. Fine, yeah, we'll do it. Everyone seems to want me to do it. All right, we'll do it. We'll do it, we'll do it, we'll do it. We'll do it, we'll do it. Fine. Oh, wait, this one has, like, save states. Oh, maybe this is longer. Wait. Because I don't have all the time in the world. You know what I mean? I only got so much time. Nah, I'm, all right, you know, fuck it. Whatever, we'll, we'll go for it. New game. We'll do it, we'll do it, we'll do it. Yippee. Yippee! First Fathom episode for three. Carson House. September 24th. My name is Noah. I'm a 28 year old male from the Midwest. I have no idea why I'm sending this, but I hope my story can be a lesson. This happened to me when I was 18. But I remember this instant like yesterday. As the trauma dictated a major part of my life. I'm hungry as well. I will have to eat after this. For a little background. 
My dad was a realtor and almost always became friends with his clients. One day he came home and pitched me a small job offer for the weekend. One of his old clients was going away for a few days and needed somebody he could trust to wash over his house. The man works as a COO at a local media company. My dad told me that uh, the man would pay me $100 just to watch the house and do some basic chores. I sent to the offer as nothing interesting going for the weekend. Besides, I thought I could use my, uh, the time to get my schoolwork done. Plus, I wasn't picky where my pocket money came from. My dad drove me to the house. Ooh. This one has a slightly different graphics. Are they? Oh, is, is this kind of laggy? Is this kind of lagging? Is it lagging a bit? Is, is it laggy a little bit? Or is it good? Not really. Okay, cool. Ah, this is a dream. There's definitely going to be like a scary sequence happen in this one. The music's kind of cool. Hello? Bleach. What? Where did you put it? Where did I put what? Where's bleach? I need bleach. What are you in this place? Who are you? Said I need bleach! No? No? No time's over, we're here. We're here! You said you could uh, you said you could do this. Wake up now. Wake up Noah. No, wake up. No wake up! Still think you can do this? I don't know, I doze off for. Doesn't matter. Can you do this now? I got this. Roy called and said the key should be under the fake rock. Got it. Says in the backyard. And like I said, keep the doors locked and don't open the doors for anyone. I do the first time, Dad. Okay, now get your ass to work. Maybe now I'm only in it for the snacks. Cool. All right, let's do this. It's a nice neighborhood. It is. Says in the backyard. I'm hungry. Why is he in the back ski seat? The, the ski? Ski Davidson? Okay, apparently there's like a fake rock. I think that's the fake rock. It's by the old dog house. Cute little doggy. Boy. That's where he keeps the sun. He keeps the dog in this one and then, you know, his son in the other. That's why he's called Boy. Cool. Alright. Let's see what snacks they got. Oh, they got some pop. That's kind of cool. To pee. I it's pee. Bathroom. Oh no, you're pissing on the lid, my guy. You're pissing on the wrong bit. You're pissing wrong. Oh wait, I'm supposed to aim. Fuck. I realized it was like a game. Shit. I was done with it. Apparently I could aim. I didn't realize this game I was going to have to like aim my piss. Let's take up the job, kid. I really appreciate you doing this. I'm sorry I had to leave early. Wait, hold on. School is full of assholes! I know, right? 
But I don't think you're an asshole. I don't think you're either. Smile. Let me call you in a bit. Pick it up. There she... Hold on, I'm trying to... My bad, it's Roy. Got this contact from Walter. Work is really getting the best of me here. I don't problem, Mr. Carson. My pressure, really. Haha. <laughs> He's my dad. Okay, hold on. Let me call you in a bit. Pick up. Really wish you could come tonight. Me too. Uh, things you do to keep your old man happy. You know, I haven't been a good kid to him. If your dad doesn't think you're... God, man, I'm trying to read. Camera. Oh, no! Shit. Wait, hold on. I can fix that. That's fixable. That's fixable. All right, hold on. Hold up. Oh, I ain't grabbed the batteries. Hold on. They're in another room. I'll be like two seconds. I'm back. Now, hold on. Let me do the camera. Hello? Is this thing on? Hello? Hello? Hello there? Hello? Alright. Yeah. Oh! Did it die instantly? Shit, that's two dead batteries. Wait, do I have I have a third, but I know if, uh, if this one isn't charged, we're kind of fucked. Okay, I've got the third battery. Hello! I'm back! Did y'all miss me? Jack behind you? No! Zeke, boy's been a little sick lately. I'll take care of him and the house now that I'm here. You have nothing to worry about, Mr. Carson. One year, oh my god. Little goofy guy. Yes! I loved thank Marble you. Hornets it. and I love this game. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. Wait, let me, let, me read, let me try and read these messages. He's like flirting with a girl or something. Your dad doesn't think you're a good kid. I don't want to know what my thinks about me, Ruffle. God almighty! Fuck you! Okay, this is dinner time. Let's go get the dog food. But let me read these fucking messages, man. God. Uh, I just think I really disappoint him with Kara. Uh, not again, Noah. You have to stop beating yourself up about it. Wait, did that bitch call you again? Just can't help but feel so stupid. It wasn't your fault, period. Anyways, got, my, uh, got some making up to do here. The I am, weekend? I'm afraid. Oh, okay. Uh, I, I guess that's his girlfriend. I'm a bit confused. I don't know who Kara is, though. I think these are, the, like, actual texts Play. from the people. So, you know. 
Makes sense. Either way, let's go feed that dog. It's in the basement, the dog food. All right, let's try and find the basement. Let's see what's through here. Ooh! Oh yeah, it said he worked at a production company. This is literally me for real. This is my life. Lasers model the garage. Oh wait, that literally is like like fourth wall break. Like the dev couldn't be bothered to model the garage, so he hasn't done it. That's really funny. I've got to lock the door. I don't think you can. I don't think there's like a lock the door option. How do you get to the basement? The basement. How do you get to the basement? How do you get there? You keep walking past it. Oh, I actually do. The basement was a little too dark. Hmm. No. Also, oh, I apologize for those lights in the basement. You can grab the flashlight in the storage room upstairs. It's not like Winston Churchill, but like if he was American. Kinda looks like Trump actually. Realize this house is way bigger than ours. Yeah, it's a fucking big house, bro. It's shit huge. The flash flashlight. Wet clothes. It's kind of gross and weird. Ah, oh, laundry room. Good to know. The laundry room is somewhere we're gonna have to hide later. Okay, so I can work here if I want. I don't want to do that just yet. I want to find where the fucking flashlight is. Oh. What? Oh, F to use. Okay, let's go. Let's go to Mr. Costa's house. Find that dog food. Where's that dog food? Food for the dog. You inspire me every day, Mr. Bald Man. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Is this lagging? This feels like it's lagging. I want to like. I wonder if there's like graphic settings I can fix or something. It, it seems laggy. Thanks for the 12 months, dude. Appreciate it. Oh, tier 3. Wow, thank you, man. I think I only have one months. tier 3 sub, Can't and it's you, it's so already I been a year, it. and you're playing one of my favorite horror games. Thank you for all the laughs, and can't wait to keep supporting you less than three. Hey, thank you, man. Seriously. Thanks a lot. Hey, Spike, or whatever your name is. I had to open the can. Oh, fuck's sake. Boy needs dinner. Feed boy. Boy hungry. Feed boy. Oh, 
How do I open this? How do I? What am I supposed? How? How? What? Boy needs dinner. Feed boy. Oh, it was that. I know what a can opener looks like. I'm proud of myself. Boy, time for foods! Come here, boy! Time to eat, boy! I'm going to go inside. Trash, bro. Oh, well, I tried. Damn, Roy! Hey, her kid, heard from Walter, your computer with her. I have a favor to ask. The computer's been acting weird lately, and my whole security system is tied to it. Yeah, I'll fix it. I don't know what I'm doing. You definitely been looking at some weird porno, though. I'm gonna find out or something. I'm gonna see your pornos, dude. And I don't want to do that, but I'm. It's gonna happen. I just know it. I just know I'm about to see some weird porno. He's a furry. I can. I'm. I'm pretty sure Mr. Carson's a furry. That's just pretty accurate. Oh, what's the? I have a lot of expensive equipment laying around, so I don't want anything happening to it. Yeah, I understand. I'll take a look at your computer. Oh my god! I didn't forget my password. Why? Well, I mean, I don't know it in the first place to have forgotten it. Boy, Zeke, boy, meow, meow. Do I have to figure out what the cat's called? L Carson five three eight seven. You sure it isn't boy? Boy. Zeke. What did he say it was? Oh. I typed it wrong. I don't know if I've got cap locks on or not. Hold on. You are my favorite streamer, and you bring joy to everyone watching. Joy and whimsy. Big up, Mr. I agree. Bald Man. No, thank you. I really do appreciate that. Thank you for that uh, 1100 bits, Sophia. It doesn't mean a lot. What is it? Five three eight seven. Five three eight seven, right? Or is it something else? Hey, I did it. Welcome. So what's wrong with this? This one's a cat of critical error. What's this? Oh! Talk and talk. Directed by Alec Carson. This video will be covering how to talk like a better person. Feel free to take a break whenever needed. I won't be. Siskin Rose, leave me the eight months. Step one. Don't be rude. That's true. Don't do that. Oh, ads! Guys, the top of the hour ad is playing. I didn't even notice. God, thank you to all the people that subbed during the top of the hour ad. You now won't have to watch any of those ever again for the rest of the month. Also, thank you to everyone who's watching the ad. It does greatly, it does greatly support the channel. Hello ad viewers, welcome back. Sorry, I completely forgot the ad was running. Uh, I'm not used to them being done automatically yet. 
I do appreciate you guys watching them though. It really does uh, support the channel. So thank you so much. Really do appreciate it. Yeah. Ooh, like analog horrors mixed in here. That was kind of interesting. Sorry, Bridget, something's wrong with the broadcast. Oh, well, this is gonna be scary, I feel like. Dog. Cool. That is boy. Boy, step two. Remain calm in any conversation. Where's his eyes? Hello. Now, even though that what he said was controversial, did you stay calm? Seems to be calm is to not let your feelings interfere with the conversation. This is really cool. Being calm makes you a better person. That's all we have for today. Brought to you by Jimmy. Jimmy Beast? Holy! I think that was from Jimmy Beast. Get an antivirus. Sophia, thank you for the five gifted subs. Appreciate it. I think we're almost 100 subs today, guys. Oh, don't fucking. Form full scan. My guy's probably got a virus, I think. Spot a Trojan. Remove that Trojan, please. Cool. Nice. Can I get to Google now? Uh... What should we Google? Um, fursuit for sale. Damn. Ah! Nice. Okay, this, you know what, not everything works. Oh, Cuba. I'm good at this game. Uh, Barbados, I think, but I don't actually know. San Marino, okay, cool. Mexico. China. Uh, I think that's Andorra. Angola? It was Andorra, fuck. Uh, Sierra Leone? Shit. Mexico. Paraguay? Fuck, I don't know that one. Jamaica, I don't know that one. Greece. Spain. Uh, Belarus? Yeah, as a guess. Uh, Venezuela, I know that one. Uh, South Africa. 
Uh, I'm enjoying this game way more. Can we just play this? Hi, T. Uh, Moldova, maybe? Yeah! Uh, oh, I know this one. Um, Honduras? Or Libya? Honduras. No, I thought so. This is Tunisia. Oh, I don't know this one. Belize, I guess? It's not any of the others. That's where um, tech billionaire John McAfee, who's... Uh, th this fake antivirus is based off of him. Uh, th when he became like a tech millionaire, he then moved out to Belize and became a crime overlord. And then he died in prison. Estonia. Uh, Uruguay. Holland. Uh, ooh. Senegal? No, it's not. Kuwait. Damn. That was fun. I enjoyed when that the game a lot. When the streamer's a genius. Thank you guys. Cool. Oh. You know, I fixed it. Uh, oh, what was it about? Weird. Reminds me of cooking with Jeffrey and Channel Ten last night. By the way, the rerun must be on right now. If you want? You gotta watch it with me. Wait, that place got a TV? Yeah, hold on. Um. It's done. It was just some charging. I'd recommend you only download software from trusted websites. That's my kid, but thanks. I'll drop you a tip, nice tip when I get back. Cool. All right. That's not Poland. That wasn't Poland. They messed up Poland. Maybe I just got it wrong. Did they get Poland the wrong way around? Did they do the flag upside down? Yeah, let's go watch TV. Jeffrey. Yeah, you're fucking scary, Jeffrey, mate. <laughs> Never mind, he's kind of cool. I love Cat food! It's my favorite dish. It's super enjoyable. And I like that they've kind of like lent into analog horror in this one. Like all the videos are really creepy. We can't eat this. It's raw. It is. So first, we are going to gently pour the cat food onto this conveniently placed on a stove. Oh, it's like 3D animated. That's really weird. This is, this is I can't tell if this is like surreal like comedy or supposed to be creepy. Upon a bosom. Oh, lucky babe. bosom? Jeffrey, your twin? Okay, now no, fuck you! We can work on Jeffrey really just be Jeffrey sometimes. Yes! He mentioned suckling upon the bosom. A piece of cardboard dipped in milk. <laughs> of cardboard, a glass, and some milk. True. To start, we pour the milk into the glass. Yeah. Handsome Squidward! Hell yeah! Next, we dip the cardboard into the milk. Uh, also, I think you should get the grosser Rios before it gets too dark outside. This is a question now that the is finished cooking, we can finally okay. serve it. This looks amazing. You're weird, bro. Hello, folks. Let me tell you this. I'm looking after this great house. Oh, I got small. I got very small. I'm going to get big again, though, folks. Just give me a second, please. Please, you got to give me a second so I can get big again. Here I am, folks! Mighty large! I'm very large! Huge, even! Anyways, this kid, this kid, uh, I don't know his name, but let me tell you this much. He's gonna go get the groceries. I think he's gonna go get the groceries. There's ads on the TV. I'm curious what's going on on the TV. I'm gonna go back. Too many fingers. I'll take them. Not what? Fingers? I'll give you more fingers. Let me tell you, folks, I have ten fingers, and I think that's a perfect amount. I think that's actually the exact amount I should have. I think I should have no less, more, no less. Check the cams. What is this, Five Nights at Freddy's? Do you think I'm going to get jump scared by some animatronics? Look at you, you're a loser. You're a loser who gets scared by animatronics. Why is he kind of slaying? Cup of milk? More like cup of mommy uncle's juice. 
What the fuck are you talking about? That's disgusting. You're weird. You're awfully weird. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Let's check those cameras. Okay, it seems pretty safe outside. I think it's safe to go outside. The window? We can check it, but I don't, I don't think there's nothing there. Yeah, we're good. I kinda like when it rains. It's stuck in my head at the moment, don't know why. Cash on your nightstand. Oh shit, we do have to go upstairs. Viagra pills on the nightstand. But it's cash instead of Viagra pills. Sorry, I think I gotta run. This dude's on my ass right now. Wants me to get groceries in the middle of the night. No, we're missing the best part. I just stole your cash, loser. How do you feel? Probably like a pretty freaking big loser, right? Probably like someone who loses. I don't do that. I win. Constantly, I win. I'm going to quickly check those cameras one more time just to make sure no one's there before I go down. Looks pretty good, I think it's pretty safe. Very self. They say sex sells, I know that it does sell. It sells possibly greater than anything. If you read my book, Art of the Deal, I actually say the best deal is a sex deal. They sell very well, I hear. Okay, I'm gonna stop this now. I don't want to put this flashlight down. I don't need that at the store. If your trouble gets something for yourself as well, it's on the house. Thank you, the house. Okay, yeah, where's the store? Take Alex's bike, it sounds like a garage. Oh, what the fuck? It's kind of creepy. Oh, I actually get to ride the bike, that's fun. I figured it'd just be like some, like... I think I just click on this and then I'd be at the store. Okay, where, where actually is the store? Okay. Okay, it does still transition. Nine twenty-two. It's not the middle of the night. It was like eight p.m. I get groceries at eight p.m. all the time. Admittedly, that's because I'm like I have a weird sleep schedule because I have a not real job. But you know, still, it's got a nux, like from Animal Crossing, but spelled different. Even better to walk and take boy. That's true. Hi, you doing good? Doing good. You? Doing good. Use a shopping basket. Alright. Uh, ranch. Huh? Hey, son, do you work here? I'm just here shopping. Huh, okay, son. Why? My son likes mustard. I came here looking for it, but I can't find it for the life of me. Do you know where it is? Come on, let me get it for you. I'm gonna help an old lady. I feel like. Well, it's gonna do well for me in the long run. I think helping an old lady is gonna, you know... I think she's gonna come and save my life when it boils down to it. Find mustard for that old lady. Well, she's right, it really is no way to be found. Curry sauce, mayo, instant ramen.
Oh, it's probably here, right? Honey. No. Is this mustard? Hello, old lady. Where'd you go? Oh, very well, there it is, haha. -ha. Thank you, son. You're welcome, lady. And speak of the devil. Turner and Andy? Bro, your girl was here. She just left. My girl? What was her name? Kara or something? Dude, so they're not dating anymore. Oh yeah, he hopped to that other chick so quick I didn't even realize. Don't listen to him. But dude, she bought tons and tons of cans. She should start like a party or something. You know anything about it? Bro, she looks way older without the makeup. Milf energy. <laughs> Fucking children. Ew, I think she's more of like a goth. Goth milf energy. Okay, kind of based though. Kind of based, but it also she's probably young, so that's weird. But like, generally the opinion of goth milf equal good. Based. Are you guys done? Let me grow up, Turner. Anyways, dude, what are you up to tonight? Nothing, just chilling. How's it for this guy, Carson, tonight? You mean Alex? He goes to school with my sister. Her kids are real weird though, especially since his parents split up. Whatever fills my pocket, I'm in for. Alright, dude, see you at school Monday then. See you around, Andy. I don't want Choco Pops. Do I? I need ranch. Strawberry jelly. Choco spread. That's peanut butter. There it is, choco spread. Milk and eggs. He didn't say what type of milk he likes, so I'm gonna just get normal. Uh, eggs. Eggs? Hey, lady. Oh, alright. Alright, cool. Uh, eggs. Uh, garden peas. Garden peas, garden peas. Hello? Why has this just become a shopping simulator, by the way? Garden peas? I can't lie, I don't really know what garden peas would look like. It's like the frozen. It's like the frozen section. This is all refrigerated shit. Where's the frozen? Hello? Oh, it's a canned thing. Right. Canned goods. Okay, they can't fall out. That's fun. Oh, they're, they're the peas. Get honey. Honey's over here. I remember seeing it. Uh, rice. Uncle Tony's only. Ketchup. Oh, that's ketchup. Don't forget milk and eggs. I didn't. All right, let's get some rice. But it's got to be that the specific brand. Uncle something. Uncle Tony's. I need to grab that. Uncle Tony's? Uncle Tony! Okay, that's just normal rice. Un Uncle Tony's. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm get a little bit of something for myself. Of course. Don't remember buying anything Mr. Carson didn't ask for. He said, get yourself something. I want to get myself a little bit of something. I got some Choco Pops. I guess I don't get something. Guess I don't get to fucking get something for myself like I was promised, dickhead. Shit, shit. No one saw that. Definitely not my friends from school. Alright, let's go. Back the way we came. Oh, it's laggy.
back into the game. 9.46 p.m. We need an IRL shopping stream. That could be fun. I got an IRL bike right now. No, this is the right house. This big one. I can't remember which house was the right one. I don't live here. I don't know. Stupid bike! Put down the Canucks. Hey, see, that's way better. That's way better aim. Your brother not wash his hands? Disgusting, child. Now you're gonna go in that guy's kitchen and touch all this shit. You're gross. You're like for real gross. Yeah, I wanna check those fucking cameras. Oh, beer. You're gross, you're disgusting. I think it's just raining outside. Oh my god. Dude, you said you're at Carson's, right? You need to see this. Search up Roy Carson divorce on the internet right now. What the fuck? Roy Carson divorce. Co-founder of BM Media claims to be receiving death threats from the angry fans of his ex-wife. What? Oh, what the fuck? Hunter News. It's not unusual for audiences to be nosy about some of the celebrities' personal matters, but sometimes it's just too overbearing. We see something similar with the case of Roy Carson, the COO and co-founder of BM Media. After his very public breakup and divorce with his wife, former actress Alyssa Brown Carson has allegedly been receiving death threats from fans of Alyssa Brown for the rumored infidelity that underwent within said relationship. Yep, big red Mr. Beast arrow, that's his house! Hey guys, just know that this is his house! Guys, this guy- Fuck. Fuck. Someone's at the front door. You go away, dude. No way, fuck. Uh, he's had people knock on the door. This hasn't been very vocal about the situation yet. Fuck, okay, I guess I gotta go down. It's fine, as long as the door's locked, it's fine. He looks like a pizza delivery guy, admittedly, which is good. Alright, let's go down then. Who is it? Delivery for your one medium size uh, from Pizza Depot, sir. I don't order any pizza. Okay, fine. Oh, you're there. Here. Oh, 
where it's safe to be out there right now, and I forgot my raincoat at the shop. Okay, so this guy wants to come inside. Uh, I'm sure my, I'm not sure my devil like that. He's upstairs. Oh, I understand. We well, have a good day, sir. Yeah, fuck that guy. I'm sure he's nice, but I, I don't want him in here. Part of me's tempted to let him in, cause like, what if later on, like, someone actually fucking scary comes, and like, he's there to protect us when it happens, you know? But equally, you know, I guess we don't want that. It seems like he left. Okay, it looks like he left. I'm willing to trust the pizza. I am hungry. My character said he was hungry. Realistically though, like, if it was me, I would have messaged Roy and been like, Look out for some pizzas, it should arrive any minute now, enjoy. You see, yeah, that was actually from Roy. Where's Boy? Oh yeah, where is Boy? I'm gonna go out looking for him, it's raining and I don't, I'm a bit, you know. Oh, we gotta watch the cooking guy again! Oh! Oh! Why is the TV creepy? Pizza was nice and hot despite the rain. Why would you let him in? Surreal entertainment. These look like they're made by Surreal Entertainment. I have been held hostage by Mr. Holland for 37 days. He makes me solve math work until my head hurts. I can't escape. Yeah, everything's good, Evelyn. Get some food? I will. Mechanical digestion. Yeah, this, the chewing is... Fuck. No, I'm gonna... That's one at the door again. I'm gonna finish my pizza first. Let me finish my pizza. Okay, now I'll get up. Check the cameras before we open any of the door. It's ever. Who's there? Oh. They're going around the side. I saw them go around. Woman in the backyard. Yeah, I saw the woman. She's not in view of the camera though. But she went round to the back backyard. Back door isn't unlocked, is it? She's left something on the doorstep. Oh, boy's there! They left something on the doorstep, but I don't need it that badly, you know what I mean? Like, I'd rather just not get it, but I feel like I have to. Why don't 
Why doesn't boy attack? Kinda wish I'd let pizza guy stay now. Now I know he was cool. Do I have to go get those? Is it like optional? Wait a bit. Yeah, let's wait a little bit. We haven't waited that long. You know? Lock the back door before you do. I don't think there's like an act to lock the doors. I think they're just, when they're closed, it's assumed they're locked. Yeah, she's definitely in the backyard. Alright, I don't think we have a choice. I think we gotta go grab them. It's been a while. I think we should go get the flowers. I don't think there's anything else we can do. We've got no other tasks. It appears that's the only way to, you know, progress the story, so. It's the bathroom, right? safe and sound before I, you know. I'd like to be safe before I do anything, please. And no one in the house. Cool. I see what this unknown sender is. Hey, how are you? What did you have for dinner? I assumed it was a wrong number. Logical. It was strange, but I dismissed the thought of, as a weird coincidence and moved on. Okay. Do some homework. One thirty-six. Okay. It was in the middle of my school work. The power went off. What was the what was the password again? It was Alec Carson? It was Alec Carson? What was it? 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 I know boy might be in danger, but I want to check the cams. So five three eight seven? No. Why is it not working? Hey, self, why do you keep ignoring me? Why are you, being all, why are you always so mean to me? You've been very immature by now. Fine. Give me like that. I don't need you anyways. Todd is so much hotter anyways. Why is it not working? Yeah, like a prank something. Hold on. Okay. Let me try this again. What's the numbers again? Fuck. What is it again? Five, three, eight, seven. Thank fuck. God, that took a second.
Swiss boy. Oh, someone out front. I saw them on that one, they moved. Can I continue with my school work like that? Okay, no one's in the house, so I guess we're good for a minute. Where is boy? I'm not going outside. Fuck that dog. I'm sorry. I I'm more important, man. The flowers have a camera. That might, that might be true, actually. You know, right now is a time I really, really wish I had, um... I had, uh... Kept the flashlight on me. I can't fucking see, I don't know what to do. Like, I don't know what to do. I can't see to even go downstairs. I left it in the front room. Boy barked. He did, but he's not there. It's not that I can see. Did you not have a flashlight? Yeah, but I left it downstairs. Okay. Can't see anyone. Fuck. Why did you leave your flashlight downstairs? I didn't fucking know I was gonna, this was gonna happen. Where do you turn the power back on? The basement, I assume? Outside. Fuck. Where? Fuck, where? Save my boy, there ain't no option to. side of the house. Here, like this door. Where? I 
I don't... Bye, boy. No, it's not. It's not there at all. this I don't trust this one little sniff Go outside, go to boy. But I can't work out where boy's barking. Cold outside. Okay. Okay, that's where the power is. Turn the power back on. Hey, boy. Like, shit's knocked over in here. Shit wasn't already knocked over in here. They are inside. Where's off camera that they could be, though? You should hide. What am I supposed to do, aren't we? Inside. There's somewhere and I can't see them. Thank you. 
thing I want to do, sorry, I, I feel like I can't talk still, is get rid of those flowers. I do not fucking want them. Get rid of those fuckers. Just in case they do have like a camera in them or something. Should I kept the pizza guy? Yeah, I really wish I had now. to do. No, I, I would rather stop. Oh, I would rather stop. God, wait, no, fuck. They're here. Um, the... I heard something downstairs. My camera died. I'm also out of camera batteries, so... They put the oven on. They've also grabbed a knife, I heard them do it. Camera died, I don't know, um... I guess I could just move it for now. I don't really... I had to go and look. No you don't, bro! I'm actually scared. Fuck. to like a safe room before I text. safe in here. Cool. Dude, he's at my place right now. We're gonna go to the movies. Oh. That's scary. I was have a tendency to be overly paranoid. That's not overly paranoid, bro. An oven went on by itself. Why are they fucking with me? Oh, bro. Hold on, let me pause the ads.
I, oh, I'm in the other room. I can speak now. Sorry, I forgot. She has a knife. Fuck. Okay, she has a knife. God, okay. I didn't mean to treat you like shit, I'm sorry! Oh my god! Oh, I can. Ha! Ah! Shit. Uh. Well! Well, well, well. Um. Well, I could go back in, but the camera's dead. And part of me kind of wants to try this one from the start. Uh, with an alive camera because uh fuck I should have just ran in that moment but I panicked holy fuck I don't want to finish it right now with no camera though it's kind of like I don't know I don't like having no camera you know what I mean and we're gonna play this again I told you to run yeah I, I saw but you know I mean hey Split second decision. It's Andy's fault. Yeah, it really fucking is. But yeah, I, I don't know. I don't. I kind of would like to finish it with a camera. Because I feel like I've just got to sit there quietly. You know? She Hulk smashed through the door. Yeah, she really did. Holy shit. Either way. Uh, since I've got no camera battery, this is a really difficult thing to do because usually I switch to my webcam and say I'm gonna end stream. But I guess uh, I will just end stream like this, cameraless. Uh, I hope you did enjoy. Uh, if you did, feel free to uh, smash that freaking like button. No, uh, if you if you did, uh, do feel free to follow. Your name will appear in, in the top left, just like Weber and James Marriott has. Thank you for a hundred subs today. Thank you for smashing the sub goal. I really do appreciate it. I will be live tomorrow, so watch out for me, because I will be there. Um, it has been a pleasure to stream for you. If you want to follow any of my socials, they're all Jack Manifold TV. That's Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, YouTube, and my Discord at discord.gg slash Jack Manifold TV. Exclamation point socials will give you a link to all of my socials, if you would like to check them out. Uh, I think that's everything. That's everything. 
Oh, and of course, check out the VODs channel, because this VOD will be up on there, as well as any other horror games I've played in the past. And I'm going to re-upload the best of video, but censored, because I want more people to be able to see it. I don't want it age-restricted, so we're going to send- I'm getting the editor to censor the best of video. We're going to take down the uh, age-restricted one and re-upload it uh, on age-restricted for you guys to watch, because I know a lot of people wanted to watch that and couldn't, uh, because of the age restriction. So, um, we're going to- we're going to get that fixed. But, um, yeah. What about the boxing VOD? Um... We'll see. We'll see about that. Either way, uh, I've been Jet Manifold TV. You've been awesome. <laughs> I love doing little cringe little outros. They're quite fun. Um, and yeah, I'll see you all soon. I'm going to find someone to raid. Uh, let's see. Which, uh, 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 Twitch.tv. I'm putting in my hold link. Let's see who's live. Uh, uh, let's raid... Let us raid, um... Let's raid, uh, purpled. Let's raid purpled. Let's raid our guy purpled. We like that guy. I like that guy a lot. I love that guy. Go show him some love. Go say hi. Uh, and I will see all you guys tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye!